But right now I'm gonna roast the bell pepper. And for all of you, this is how I do it. So I was, when you do this, you kinda wanna find a pepper that's not all crooked. So this is the least crooked I could find because it makes it easier if they're just like big flat sides. So you wanna roast each side. Once, uh, once you see one side done, and this is pretty much as good as you can get there, you just wanna turn it so all the sides get nicely blackened because it's cooking the, uh, the pepper on the inside. Bringing out the, the sweetness. Check the pepper again. It's good progress. Almost all sides. I'm gonna get some of the uh, parts that haven't, they're having a hard time getting done. Basically, you wanna try to get it all black all over. So I think that's pretty much about done. Key for that is just to let it um, get to room temperature. And uh, you cover it up. But this way, the con condensation of the steam makes the skin come off a little easier. Let's try to peel the bell pepper. It's still probably a little hot, but it's had some time to cool and the skin will hopefully come off pretty easily. All right, so what we do is just comes off like this. And so here are the sections that I didn't get black and that they're kind of sticking to the uh, pepper a little bit more. The ideal is to get it all off, like get all the black stuff off, but I often am not able to completely do it. So I just kind of rinse it under some water, um, which is not always the best because then you lose some of the flavor of the, of the like the pepper juice and stuff, but at the same time, you don't want black stuff in your hummus or on your pepper. So there you go, it's pretty clean.